Welcome back to some more Hypixel Skyblock Iron Man. Today we set out to craft Skyblock's most powerful enchant and the most complex crafting recipe in the game. With Mayor Marina in office, it's the perfect time to take on crafting our first Bobbin Time book. So if you're looking forward to the grind, hit that like button. Y'all hit the crazy goal of 1300 last time. So let's see if 1400 likes is possible. And if you like what you see or just find yourself watching multiple of my videos, hit that subscribe button. We're so close to 120,000 subscribers. If you can hit the button on this video, then we'll get there by the end of the day. And lastly, if you ever buy ranks, gems, or anything on the Hypixel store, use my supporter creator code at checkout for a sweet 5% off your order. My code is Toad, T-O-A-D, and my code stacks with other discounts and sales on the store, so it's the perfect time to get that rank you've been eyeballing for the last month. Yeah, I'm looking at you. Anyways, there's a fishing festival starting like right now, so let's get into it. Before we get into the fishing festival, let's go ahead and take a look at the bobbin time recipe. I actually have most of the materials, if you remember from our last video. The only ones we were missing are in the the shark water orb, or whatever it's called, the shark- yeah, the shark water orb. We need these 12 enchanted razor- or enchanted shark fins which are kind of a pain to get. They're drops from sharks, and, uh, well, you can only get that during marina, during the fishing festivals. And the last item we will end up needing is going to be in the uh, lava water orb. I only have one thunder shard, so we're gonna have to fish up another thunder, and that might be a little bit tough. But we only need one more, so, uh, there's a fishing festival starting in a little bit. Let's go ahead and get to that right now. So we're all ready for this first fishing festival here. If we take a look at my stats, I have 97 sea creature chance and 208 fishing speed. That'll be 238 once I drink this glowy tonic. We're using our level 99 flying fish. Hopefully this thing will level up during this festival. Uh, normally I would kind of walk you through the first few minutes of the first festival I do, but I'll do that for the second one because it's actually pretty late right now. Uh, Marina ends in two days and I did the math. I have to go to three or four of these fishing festivals, which means kind of got to go to some of the ones that are at night for me. So I'm just going to zone out and uh, if anything cool happens, of course, I'll show it. Uh, I will be recording this whole time. But more or less, we'll probably just cut to the end and see how many of these uh, remaining razor shark fins are- not razor shark fins, enchanted shark fins that we end up getting by the end of this festival. And that's the end of the fishing festival. It's really late, so I gotta be super quiet here, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and take out the rest of these mobs here. I'm using my flying fish instead of my G-drag to take these out, just because I want the fishing XP to go on that. But uh, there we go. We actually got a ton of stuff this festival. And uh, I think I can make one more enchanted shark fin right here. So we'll do that, and not quite enough for one more. I actually got crazy rates right now. I mean, we have 11 out of the 12 shark fins. I'm pretty sure if I search a bob in time here, I think it's 11 shark fins that I need. Or 12? 3, 6, 9, 12. Yes, 12 shark fins is what we need. And we're pretty much done. Um, I mean, I have to do the next festival anyways. Uh, looks like my internet's cutting out, which is a little bit awkward, but I guess that's okay timing. So uh, I guess I'll call it there and uh, I'll get ready for the next festival probably in the morning. Got about 10 seconds till the next fishing festival starts. So uh, just kind of getting my gear ready to go here. Should have everything we have 52 more minutes of tonic, but I'm just gonna show you pretty much how I, uh, well, do this fishing event because I was almost asleep last time, and to be honest, I woke up five minutes ago and realized, oh, I almost missed the festival, so, yeah, pretty much gonna start right now, but basically, I placed down a totem of corruption in the hub. I'm actually in a private hub. Someone's here, which is concerning. I might leave, but, uh, generally, you want to find your own private hub and then just go over to the barn, then hop up over on this left side, basically stand exactly where I'm standing. There's my cords if you want to see them, and place down your totem of corruption and just spawn as many sea creatures as you physically can. And then once your totem of corruption is about to run out, you just place it down again. And what I like to do is after the second totem almost runs out, then is that's when I go ahead and go down and take out all the mobs that are down there. So usually you'd want to go about four minutes to four and a half minutes. This ends up going like three minutes, 50 seconds or so. Hi! Or if I get one of those, I just go down and take them out. So up to my uh, sorrow armor set and just kind of roast all of these guys. Generally, uh, if there's just like a great white left, I'll just like use my hype a couple times to get him lower and then just spam my daedalus axe until he uh actually ends up going down so there we go no loot from that one but we did get one skyblock xp so since uh i did that i'm just gonna reset my timer and do another four minutes here and then once those four minutes are up i just kill them again and rinse and repeat until the event ends so yeah i actually don't need to do this entire event so i probably won't do the whole event but yeah we're just gonna look for a couple more of those enchanted fins and then we'll be set well almost we'll need one more ingredient before we can get bobbin time. And of course, it's the hardest ingredient of them all. 
there are four tiger sharks in this pit full of like 10 mobs here so i'm pretty sure something's gonna happen after i start killing these and flying fish level 100 there we go look at that we finally have a level 100 uh flying fish that took so long uh 75 fishing speed is going to be awesome and of course the uh, souvenir is giving it the 5c future chance that's not base stats my inventory is full but we actually do now have more than enough enchanted shark or uh, enchanted shark fins to complete the bob and time it is not the final material we need so we're gonna just probably keep fishing for a bit because why not but uh if we search up bob and time here it should only take 12 3 6 9 12 yep indeed we are done all right well i'm gonna fish for a little bit longer until i'm kind of sick of my inventory being full and then we'll uh, hunt the last material down i finished up fishing so let's take a look at what we've gotten over the last two festivals because we're actually done so this is all of our bob and time materials every single thing Thing in this chest is related to crafting the bobbin time enchantment it is the most ridiculous crafting recipe i have ever seen in this game or in any game at all even like in terraria okay well there's a couple in terraria that are <laughs> yeah you know if you know you know but uh let's take a look at some of the stuff we've gotten um i'm going to the wrong backpacks so i want backpack three Oh, uh, we got a total of five great white tooth sharks, or great white shark tooths, I should say. Wow, I'm not able to talk. Um, 14 enchanted razor shark, or enchanted shark fins. I don't know why I keep calling them razor shark fins. I think it's because it says razor in the description of it. Uh, and we got a handful of megalodon pets. If I just search, uh, megalodon here, uh, we can kind of just count them up. Uh, I don't think I have any in these. I think they're all in my ender chest, actually. Uh, we got a total of four. I think I got another one. No, just four. All right, four is still pretty darn good. In fact, I think I can NPC, or not NPC sell them, but sell them to George over here for, you know, a decent amount of money. So let's see. Yeah, 500k each. I will gladly take that two mil for free. Oh, I just put one of them in my stupid pet menu. Gosh dang it, man. All right. You take that back, man. There you go. And all right, we're up to 4.3 mil. I wish I had 700,000 more coins because I know there's a recombobulator sitting in a chest that I only have a day more to collect from the uh, the dungeon guy, but that's okay. So what I think we're going to go ahead and do now is the last item we need is a thunder shard i currently have one thunder shard and people are probably fishing oh no they're not uh, in this chest i have one thunder shard but you actually need two so i'll have to fish up the rarest sea creature i can possibly fish up right now a thunder but before i do that i actually have a ton of these uh fishing bait the obfuscated tier one baits and i'm gonna try and finally get the, fi the last trophy fish i need to have all gold which is the tier three obfuscated gold which i've been trying to get for months and it's just not happening because as soon as i get that darn trophy fish i can make an absolute absolutely incredible upgrade to our fishing gear for lava but uh first we need to go ahead and get another mushy glowy taunt or mushed glowy tonic potion so i'm gonna do that and i'm gonna trophy fish for a little bit and hopefully we'll get something good from that actually first we have a little bit of an exciting recipe to craft here so what do i need i need two enchanted bones okay i'm gonna be upgrading one of my uh fishing equipment pieces let me just grab some enchanted bones here and pretty much all of these shark teeth i think i need one two three four five six seven eight and then a bunch of tiger shark teeth i think that's all i need and i need to make two of these great white teeth bone meal which is just crafted like this with one enchanted bone in the center like that and then i need to grab my where is it my i don't know how to pronounce that i'm not gonna try <laughs> and we're just gonna go ahead and uh upgrade this let me just uh where is the belts they're all the same okay so it's crafted like this with this on the bottom these two on the bottom and then just a bunch of teeth in the left and right and wave belt this will give an upgrade of four fishing speed and nothing else we care about but you know four fishing speed is four fishing speed nonetheless uh i don't have enough enchanted or great white shark tooth teeth teeth i don't even know at this point to get the next one so we're just gonna have to keep this in here for now i'm actually gonna put the bones back in my sack so i don't lose them uh i almost forgot to use where is it the gloves right here instead of this because this isn't going to help us for trophy fishing but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and go to trophy fishing i got my mushy glowy tonic potion ready to go gonna drink it with a parrot pet in about six minutes here but let's go to the aisle and i don't know if i'm gonna show anything of this or not it's pretty much if i get the gold or not that'll be what it is so uh yeah let's get started this will probably take four hours to get through all this bait oh what i just loot shared a thunder shard <laughs> no way dude no way all right well that solved the problem i was gonna have later on today um just loot shared the final thunder shard for bob and time so we actually have everything we need for bob and time um i'm still gonna go ahead and do this first because i don't want to melt my brain crafting for four and a half hours 
So, I guess I'll, uh, I don't know, let me see how well this obfuscated fishing goes, and then we'll go ahead and make the bobbin time enchantment. What? What? That's like the third rarest one! Dude! I'm sorry? Soulfish Diamond? Dude, I'm just trying to get tier 2 obfuscate a bit, I don't need this thing! Oh my gosh, okay. Guess I'm putting that in the video, okay. Um, I don't know what to say, That that's cool, I guess, yeah. Freaking fishing 40, yes, fishing 40! Let's go. All right, oh, there's a thunder. I missed the thunder. No, he's over here. He's over here. Oh, I almost died. Okay, let me just loot share that sucker. All right. All right, it's finally time to craft the most ridiculous crafting recipe in all of Skyblock. I'm gonna try and do this. Uh, I have five different screenshots pulled up on the left of my screen here. So the first thing we need is uh the water orbs so to make those we need pretty much everything i'm putting in here there's just gonna be a lot of me saying we need everything that i'm putting in here i need the emperor skulls i'm pretty sure i need four of these uh we need the prismarine crystals and the shards and then the fish so there we go we're going to need four of these water orbs so just like that there's four and the next thing we'll need is the shark orb and this is going to take three or four sets of three fins like that the great white tooth on the top the tiger shark teeth on the bottom the rare ones on that side and the uncommon ones on that side with the water orb and there we go there's the shark orb next up we are going to make i actually have to uh open this in a full screen because that's such a small screen the winter orb which is made with two stacks of hunk ice split into that the presence on the left and right and then the snow on the top hunks of blue ice on the bottom another water orb in the middle there's the second orb the winter water orb next up we have the lava orb or actually no this is the spooky orb uh it's pretty similar to the shark orb actually so it's just like this with the uh soul fragment on the top and then not mugma pelts i need a werewolf skins like like this and the water orb there there we go oh am i actually gonna be able to do this without messing up the recipe and the last one we need the magma fish on the top for the lava one i don't have enough mugma pelts on me hold on i actually need to uh grab a stack of mugma pelts so we'll just do that there we go and all right, now we can actually make it. I almost did this perfectly. The Mugma Pelts on the left, the... Oh, I didn't grab enough of any of this stuff. For some reason, I thought it was 32. We need this. We need these. Nope, not Flaming Hearts. I guess actually, yeah, we did need Flaming Hearts. And then we have 32 Cups of Blood. Okay, so now we should be able to make this correctly and be done. Not the blood. I need the... Uh, there we go. We need this. I need the blood on the bottom. The Horns of Taurus on the very bottom. Then 32 of those on the side. And then 64 of those there. Two Thunder Shards. And the final water orb. There we go, the lava orb. And of course, the final recipe is going to be like this. Uh, I think it's... Oh, man. I didn't take a screenshot of this recipe either. I think it's like this. There we go. Bobbin time three. 24 million coin enchantment. Wasting so many resources, but this is going to be super good. I realized that I don't exactly want to put this on Thunder Armor. I would probably rather save it for Magma Lord Armor because let's be honest, eventually they're going to add Fishing 60. So I think it would be best if I save this and just save it until I have my first piece of good Magma Lord and put it on that instead. I mean, my Thunder already has Legion, so we're just gonna hang on to that for now, but that is absolutely awesome to have. Let's take a look at the stats one more time for it. Uh, for every player within, or with for every Fishing Bobber within 30 blocks of you, you get plus 0.48 to the following stats. Sea Creature Chance, Fishing Speed, Fishing Wisdom, Magic Find, and Pet Luck. That is absolutely insane. By far the best, probably the best enchant in Skyblock, let's be real. So I'm so, so happy to finally, finally have that done. Real quick, something I want to do is go ahead and level up my parrot pet just a little bit more. I had 19 enchanted sugarcane uh, just chilling in an ender chest that I didn't need. So uh, I just went ahead and made some speed seven pots for some alchemy. And hopefully we're going to get some pretty good levels on this guy. So when we drink our mushy glow tonic potion, uh, it lasts even longer. Uh, we can see it's, it's gaining levels very slowly. I feel like I'm doing something wrong, to be honest, because I don't know. I just remember pets leveling up way faster, like sheep and stuff, just way, way faster. I also thought these sold for more than five thousand coins i'm probably i'm most likely doing something wrong but oh well at least it's leveling up somewhat fast so can't be like too worried about it hopefully this thing will be level 80 by the time i'm done with all of these potions i wish they didn't take ages to sell but that's just how it is with all of the mods i have set up for like slot locks and stuff just makes it so i can't drop any items on accident but 
Looks like we're definitely going to be able to get this to just about level 80, which is awesome. And there we go. That's oh, oh not quite level 80. There we go. Level 80. All right. Pretty much exactly where I wanted to get it to, which is good. Uh, can I do the cell trick on these? Oh, I can. Oh, that's sick. All right, cool. <laughs> well, that's nice. All right. Made a couple, a little bit of money back from that. Whatever 6,000 times 57 is, I can actually just check. 57 times 6,000. We made roughly 340k back, a little bit less than that. So yeah, our parrot's level 80, and now boosts potion duration by 33%. All right. But anyways, that's gonna do it for this episode of Iron Man. Quick reminder to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and use code TOAD on the Hypixel store. Also, go check out my second channel. I'm really trying to push this channel more. So if you could, in the pinned comment, I linked to my most recent video over there. We do Let's Plays of other games, and it's been so, so much fun. So if you like my Skyblock stuff, I'm sure you'll love it over there. The end card will also have a few links on the second channel, and I encourage you to go check it out. Anyways, that's it for today. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you real soon.